in Rocket League, what if Leapish was Leapish was in Smash? Yes, this is Leapish. She is a part of a Grog decal. into another video now the reason why I didn't post yesterday was actually I did I did actually post yesterday it was that um that it was about cookie clicker too I was gonna find the end of it but I don't think it has any ending so yeah just decided after I mean, after a one-day break, which I used to do every single day. I mean, the reason why I chose this card instead of the Grog was... I'm choosing the card that I think should most likely be it, so... This is, like, the tallest card in the game, I think. So... I mean, if you don't know where Leapis is at, she's basically at Neo Tokyo. Now, I did... What if Bob was in Smash? I don't really think the move set before these, so yeah, I might miss a couple things. So yeah, if you're wondering where Leapus is at, she's basically right here. So I don't really think the move set, like I said in these type of videos, so I might miss a couple things. Comment down below what I missed if I don't recognize it at all. Now the first thing that Leapus has is well since she is literally, okay, I, I don't know where she's at, but, um, since she's right here, yes, I'm using the photo for this, there's literally a ball right next to her, so, her entrance is just gonna be kicking that, um, black ball, which will pop up in a second, yeah, that black ball, she'll kick it, and she'll be like that, that type of pose of kick. And she won't kick it in the middle, she'll kick it like this way. And well, yeah, it's basically just her falling down with that black ball. So, yeah, she's, yeah, she's basically just gonna, um, when she lands down to her destination, like where she's supposed to be at in Smash in the start. She's gonna be like, I mean, the ball's gonna be like launching out like the fastest kook or pinch ever. This is a kook or pinch. Okay, so I can't really do the kook or pinch, but a kook or pinch is basically like when you, when the ball gets up into a wall. Yeah, you might think that's it, but um, when a ball comes up up into a wall and then you just dash into it I can't really do it and then just makes it and then just make a goal that's what a kooks or pinch is so yeah the fastest version of that will be how fast the ball will strike to her entrance now what about her jab one word square key now, I think the square cube just originated from the stage. So, the square cube is going to be, like, her jab. Well, it's not going to be her jab directly, like, bitch, just throwing it. Well, I know one character that has one jab. But, let's just do something more special. She, she throws the square cube for the first jab. And then it just bounces right back to her to the second hand she'll grab and then she'll, she throws it and then you might think she's gonna do that again rapid version but no she's just gonna throw it i mean she's just gonna throw it into the ground and then just jump on like the kooks or pinch fastest one of the but um it, yeah it does have a rapid version though um it's the zerk it's basically the same thing but instead of like putting it on the ground and then just it's gonna be like 
drop, it's just gonna be like, like that. And the finisher is just gonna be like, and it whacks in his belly, and then she grabs it into his inner air. Because when she does that again, um, she's still holding it, but it's like bigger, but she just grabs it. And yeah, it disappears. So um, yeah, that's for its entrance and its grab. Now what about its side attacks? Like, just a regular attack, the one that you press A with. Well, um, she'll use her carrot, right? She'll use that blasting full carrot. I feel like that should be a boost already. Oh, I, oh yeah, I think that's beast mode. But, um, yeah, Lepis will just use her carrot, like, in a duel, like, she's gonna be, like, the side attack will just be, and then, kind of like a jab, and then the up attack is just gonna be, like, whoo, like, the, the beginning to the final smash, and then the down attack will just be, like, plucking a carrot, Except it just doesn't throw, you don't throw it, it's just kind of like, the plucking part takes damage. And yeah, that's for its attacks. Now let's do its side smashes. Now this will include Bob. Bob's Ramen. For Lepis smash attacks. Now I already did, what if Bob was in smash? But it's basically like the Roy Chrome, because I think... Um, and Chrome Final Smash, Roy's in it still, so it's like that. So, um, yeah, um, we got her, um, I mean, the, the Smash attacks are just gonna be with Bob's Ramen, not actually, but one of them might be. So, first off, Bob's ramen f full body for her side smash. It's just, she's just gonna push Bob's ramen like that full body of him. And then she's just gonna push him. And he's holding his ramen too. So. Yeah, there's a 50 50 that'll break and just take more damage if that's a combo. Right, now, next up, we got is the upper smash. Which is basically just going to be Bob's Ramen. Just use the Bob's Ramen as a whip into this guy. And then the, the down smash is just going to be the same thing. Kind of like the carrot. She puts the ramen on the ground. And then she basically just levitates her leg. Like one of them like that. And then the other one like that. And the body's like this and yeah it's like that and then she basically just slashes out that way for the actual down smash it's not like clouds like side special but it's like but it's like this <laughs> like just a whole whack it's just part of the down smash now, also, when I said that she's basically levitating on ramen, I mean, like, that's basically the charge up part, so it's like, and then she does that, and then levitates her leg, like that. So, yeah. The reason why I'm using this card instead of the grok, you know, I think I already said it already. Now, off to Lepis's grab. Now, Lepis' grab is just going to be with, um, with the carrot, with the, with, you know, if you just look behind the carrot, you'll see blue stuff. And yeah, that's what we're going to use for the grab. It's just going to be with the lepis. So yeah, her grab is just going to be out of the blue thing, out of the carrot. And it's just going to be like a tether grab. So yeah, this is a far ranged grab. So yeah, another useful carrot. And it's basically 
like this. Kind of like Metro's Grab. I mean, I don't know what her name is. Your Samus. So it's like this. And then she brings it back. So it's like. So, yeah, that's what it's like. So, yeah, since that happened, the grab, I mean, the throw, some of them are also going to include this carrot. So, first off, you guys, the scythe throw, which is probably the most inf infamous one, probably. She, he, she lets go of the carrot that, and part that it grabs, which there's some part of button right here. Yeah, I don't know. But, yeah, she basically uses that part of the carrot to just blast the person away. So it's like... It's kind of for a couple seconds, too. Next up, we got is the down throw, which kind of mixed with the back throw. So, the, so, basically how this works is the back throw, I mean, the down throw is just going to be like, the grab is still there, and then, and then it's like back, backwards. Mm, yeah. It digs that person to the ground. Back throw is kind of the same concept, but it's, but it's not. It's basically like throwing someone into the air with that carrot grabbing thing. And also, fun fact about the battle bus. I know I'm off topic, but what are these three things? <sighs> so anyway, let's go back. So... She basically just used the thing that she grabs with, throws it into the air. I mean, she doesn't throw that into the air, but she throws the person into the air. Up. And then when it comes down, it's right behind her. Yes, right here. And then next up, we guys, the actual up throw, which will basically just be this. She basically unlatches it and then just grabs the person, launches into the air. And then next one, um, you know, I, I think that's all the throws. Now, the next throw, I mean, the next thing is specials, right? So, so the next special is going to be, um, I'm trying to think of an idea while just shooting. I mean, that's an epic shot, by the way, with only one hand. And, yeah, I waited 11 minutes and 14 seconds just for that shot. I mean, no, I did not, but, uh, yeah. So, um, her first smash attack. Okay, now I know the special attack. It's gonna be about this. See that laser thing? Yeah, that's the special attack. She basically just charges it up. Now, how many seconds is it going to be? It's If it's one second that it's charged up, it's only going to be one bar. And if it's just going to be like, just press bay right away, it's just going to be like half of it. So. Yeah. <laughs> now, next up, we guys, the next bar, which takes two seconds, and so on, the three second... The third second is just going to be all of it. So, if you're holding it as much as long as you can, like Ike's side special is just going to be three seconds max. And then next up we got is its side special, which basically she just pours out this beer, this red beer. And then what does, and then what does she do with that? Well, it's basically kind of like a stop side special so so it's like this okay yeah it's like this and you can walk during it but it's like instead of like and then pour 
it's like just regular porn. Like it's right behind. So it's so it could be like this. And yes, it's the lava, so it's like pouring behind you with that beer. Now, I haven't really named any of these attacks yet. So you know it's the side special is just gonna be called Spilling Beer Fire. The special attack, the regular special attack, is just going to be called the laser gun. And then the uh, grab attacks, I mean, the throws, the grab is just going to be called the carrot. I'm losing, which also could be called the tether grab. And then the throw is just going to be like, I mean, the fourth throw is just going to be called the blast persistence. The sound throw is just going to be called I don't know what to call the back there. The up throw is just going to be called Magnificent Wind. And, yeah, I think that's all. Oh, yeah, the normal attacks, which is the one that you press A with, if I'm correct. I never pressed that Joy-Con in a while. But, um, yeah, those names, I don't really remember what those are oh yeah those are the ones with the carrot or the ramen i don't really know <laughs> but um yeah i mean okay hold on all right now we got is it's up, up special now this is kind of the same with the carrot i can't believe how much we used a carrot for it which I'm glad of, but, um, this carrot, right here, the blue thing, the uh, up special is just gonna be, like, her just using the carrot, like, levitating once again, and then she basically just uses the power of the blue thing, which I'll just call the levitation carrot, and then it's just gonna be, like, whenever someone touch it, touches it, it could be a combo, but um, whenever someone touches it, they get the poison effect, which means every second they get wind damage, but also poison, and they also get zapped for as much as much damage as it gets. I don't know what a, the second much is for. Now we got is down special. Now this is about Bob's ramen and his full body again. So basically, um. Yeah, the, this would just be a counter attack. Oh, this counter will work. I'm not sure if we did this already, but this counter attack will just be like, she'll just, I mean, there's going to be a blue shield and whenever someone hits it or someone while that blue or that character while that blue shield is still there. Um, yeah, Bob Ramen is just going to use that bowl of ramen that he has, which he's grabbing, by the way. And then, ever someone hits that, it's just gonna be, like, throwing the ramen and the bowl with the ramen. Well, next up, we got is the final smash, which is just gonna be this green thing, right? Okay, I don't know where it's at. But it's a green thing, right? here yes that green thing is not the final smash but it's gonna get the final smash in so it, it's basically like he plucks his tongue out and then he while he does that it's kind of like the part of the smash plucks his tongue out the person comes inside and then yeah what's inside it is just what the final smash is about now also they get a poison effect because of that I call this, um, the ramen. No, I just call this the, the lizard attack, which is, which the whole thing is just going to be, like, the lizard just comes, like, to get 
take you inside and get like whatever person or like the rocket league car inside of him and then it's gonna last for about like two sec i mean a second inside and then afterwards i mean it's gonna last about two seconds inside because i mean like every millisecond inside of that of him it's just gonna be a damage so yeah it's just gonna be a second long final smash but the leap is i mean how will this start off so basically how this will start off is Lepus just grabs that gra that thing. I mean, it blo it goes out side of that part. I mean, this out of the carrot, and yeah, this comes out, and then yeah, that's where the final smash starts. All right, now let's um now let's do the others. So, um, so, now, we, now we're gonna do the skins, and the first skin is just what you're gonna see. Yeah. The first skin is just gonna be this. The first skin is this. Right. The second skin is just gonna resemble the garage. Just gonna be the um, yeah yeah it's just gonna be this lepus right here that's what the second skin is going to be now the third skin is going to be this guy I mean, I mean it's not gonna be that guy but it's gonna like the colors of Lepus is just going to resemble um, Bob's ramen coach. So, yeah, she's, so yeah, Lepus is just going to wear Bob's ramen colors, including the ramen, too. Now, next skin we got is just Lepus. But she kind of looks like a bunny, to be honest. But Lepus is just going to be um, resembling color of this Lepus bunny. So, um, yeah. Alright, now the fourth skin. We're just going to watch this video. So, um, the fourth skin is just going to be this Buffy Hugo. So, yeah, the... Next skin is just gonna be the Buffy Sugo skin, is that like the Buffy this one. Sugo character so we um, see yeah, it's like a skin, the Bowser Jr. ones. So yeah. Make his first appearance in the Neo Tokyo map. Yeah, but also fun fact, it was actually already on one of the Grog decals called. Yeah. So yeah, those are the four skins. I don't know another one, but um. And, yeah, I'm sure YouTube knows, I'm sure. Yeah, it doesn't have any Rocket League variations, but also, I don't know what it would be. So, um, those four skins, I don't know what are going to be the other, um, three and, um, so, um, I don't know what other three skins it should be. So, comment down below what it should be, and I'll shout at you in the next video. And I'll, I'll and I will also say what content you make. So, um, yeah, without further ado, just like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And it and if and you maybe be subscribed once is that um YouTube has a glitch where um when you subscribe 
it's gonna up unsubscribe one day. And yeah, there's a story about that too. So, um, yeah, there it is. What if Leapist was in Smash? Now, um, this video is, um, I don't know what to say, but, um, this video is not sponsored by anything, so, yeah, let's, let that out the outro play. I still don't know why I do this, but just let it play for once. Hello guys, welcome back into another video. And, um, yeah, you might read the title already. Um, this video is about playing playing less in free play. So what I mean is like this. We go into like, oh, what is the best thing for me to practice in free play? It's probably because you like free play, you're just you're doing stuff in that, but we're just gonna make it so that you have no reason to do it. So yeah, you might still practice these shots, but I'm, but I'm telling you, you're probably just gonna be better off like shooting into the sky because you're probably not gonna do that anyway. I just use custom training packs, but who just wants custom? But who just wants just boring old custom training packs, dude? Um, I swear that someone has. To be using custom training packs and you still use this free play. So they probably listened to that tip already. And yes, I'm using the lantern light. Tail by my boost for a second. Yes, this is yeah, this is the type of video that where it just flex everything in front of camera. So. I was got now the reason why I wore this in today's video, I don't know why, I'm not gonna, I'm, I mean, I know why, I'm not gonna say it though. This Rocket League video is a bit different today, I'm going to coach you. Oh, you're gold, how can you coach us? I'm not really coaching you, I'm just actually just making you just spend less hours in free play. So, yeah, it's like that. Rocket League, what if 